Uh, I'm Chocolate. My name is Miguel. This is Scotty with a Scottish accent. This is little Scotty right here. Little Scotty. Uh, my name is David Rodriguez. Hello, my name is Timothy Carrillo, and I'm in the Rough Start program at Salinas Valley. I run a program at Salinas Valley State Prison with inmates who train shelter dogs. And um, it's really great. The dogs go and live with them for around two months and they help the dogs overcome sickness, fear, help them become more adoptable. And it's a really great program for both the dogs because it benefits the dogs. It gives them really great skills to go into their new home and it helps the inmates. They have a lot of time and they do such a wonderful job and it helps them want to be better people. Oh, this program means a lot to me. Uh, it gives me my sanity for one. It's teach me to have patience, you know, be patient and learn that uh, all these dogs, they're just kind of like us. They've been through uh, a lot of trials and tribulations and so it's an honor. The best part is being able to give them an opportunity, you know, to be able to uh, show the community out there that they also can get another second opportunity. If, if given one, they have the opportunity to change, you know, they have the potential, that gift, you know, and um, that's what I look forward to being able to help them out, uh, get that second opportunity to be adopted. My favorite part is just getting to be with the dogs and helping them out and hopefully get them a, a, a home. That's, that's the goal, to get them adopted. Sometimes we'll see like a little shy dog that doesn't want to come near a person, doesn't want to interact with you, it's just hiding. And then by the end of their two months down there, you see them playing and they've learned little, learned you know, their basic manners. They can sit and they can down and they can stay. When I go to greet them, you see them like wagging and wiggling their tails. So it's like this little character, he came and he was in a dark place, didn't want to be touched or anything. Four weeks later, now he can't keep him off nobody. Social butterfly. <laughs> there is just something about dogs and animals that just brings out the best in people. They're so loving and they come and cuddle with you and hang out with you. And I think that might be a big part too of why the inmates love it so much. They not only touch us, but they touch a whole lot of people here. From the biggest guy to the smallest guy, you know, no matter what shape, color, or form, they give you love one way or another. Mm -hmm. Each one have brought something different to me, you know. Meepaw. They did more for me than I yes. did for them. You know, and I thank the rest of for that a whole lot. Um, well, i just like to appreciate you guys for putting your time in on us and, you know, giving us a chance, giving us a, that chance to uh, prove ourselves that even though we're behind these walls that we could be rehabilitated and we could contribute to society still, even from in here. Thank you to the SPCA for bringing it here and I got lucky being here and was able to be in part of this program and that's it, I love, I love this program.